I get what this guy is saying and while this amount of money wouldn't really help me if it was in my currency, an equivalent to that for me would be around 100 to 150 million JMD, which if this guy lives in the states, the currency exchange would actually be pretty close to what I'd need to live comfortably in a home I'd call my own, where I'd water my plants and feed my birds. I'm only guessing that this person lives in America though, based off some of the comments that were below this. This kind of lifestyle would be nice to have, it would be calm, peaceful. Honestly, the reason why some rich people end up committing crimes mostly because these crimes allow them to make more money. Mostly. I can't say flat out all of them because I don't know most rich people. I can only guess based off the information given to me through the news and reports. Some can call it ambition, some can call it greed. It could be a mix of both. Being rich allows a different experience, a different kind of lifestyle from the norm. You see things differently. But one thing rich people tend to realize is that there will always be things out there that can make them even richer. So they work, they hustle, even if that hustle is illegal. I guess you could say they want to see how high they can go. Another reason rich people might commit crimes is because, maybe, they feel like they are able to get away with it. And that's true. With enough power and influence, some rich people don't even need to worry about the consequences of their actions and get off scot-free, or at most, with a slap on the wrist. With that sense of immunity comes a heavy dose of mean character syndrome, a very intolerable disease that makes one feel like they are untouchable. It's really bad and nearly uncurable. If I had enough money to make me comfortable, I don't think I'd commit any crimes. I'd build businesses, sure, to create some generational wealth, but no crimes. These are basically all my thoughts on this little JPEG. Going to go browse Reddit, I'll report back to you later.